This is Mark Dickinson, and you're watching Spartan Icon. Right, Mark, congratulations. 2-0, how's that sound? 2-0 uh, sounds great, mate. It's what I wanted to end the year on, so, yeah, I'm pleased. So how was your performance out there, do you think? Um, a lot different from my first fight. I was in with a light heavyweight. I'm a middleweight, so um, my coach, Ben Davison, he done that so I could get the rounds in, you know. Because when I first started, I didn't know what I was doing. So I was just getting used to it, and then I started getting used to it, and then I started getting used to it, and then I started getting used to it, I don't think the middle weight's taking them shots all night, so we need the valuable rounds, you know. I was going to say, because uh, you were hitting him with some huge body shots, some uh, huge left hooks, and uh, he was still standing. Yeah, so the first two rounds, I wouldn't lie, I tried to get him out of there. I was looking for it. Then I realised he's a tough man, he's a um, natural heavier man. He wasn't going anywhere, so I used my brain, used my skill, and I enjoyed the performance. So what's on next for you then? Um, next, I'm going to enjoy Christmas with my family. Uh, straight as soon as the new year comes, I'm back down in Essex, I'm grinding away and I'm staying as active as I can in 2022. And how many fights are you looking for next year, do you think? As many as my management team, my promotional team will give me. Yeah. yeah. And uh, what about uh, tonight's show then? So you're p uh, part of the very first Probellum UK based show. Yeah. Well, did you hear the crowd when I got into the ring? I was mental. Yeah, it was crazy, wasn't it? it was, oh, dream come true, you know, fighting for my own fans, my family. My uncle's done it here, now it's my turn to do it here, it's a dream come true. I was going to say, like with those fans, where's all that come from then? If you just built up that following then? Um, to be honest with you, man, I didn't realise I had that big of a following. Um, I've been, because I've been boxing in the amateurs, I was boxing in the likes of Russia, I've been in Russia, Ukraine, uh, I've been in the Bahamas, all over, the, all over any country you can think of, I've been to boxing in the amateurs and I've not really got the chance to box in front of my home crowd. So to get the chance to box in front of my home crowd and show everyone my skills, I think it's got everyone talking, you know, and um, I'm just ready to go through the levels. Well, it's a hell of a performance, so congratulations. Oh, thank you very much. I appreciate that, mate. Thank you.